According to UNICEF, Nigeria has the second highest burden of stunted children in the world, with a national prevalence rate of 32% of children under five. The, with this, the Oyo State Commissioner for Health, Dr. Oluwa Sirimi Adetumobi, Dr. Titilayo Falade of the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture, IITA, Kemi Jeje of Community Pot, and others have called on Nigerians to eat well to have a healthy nation. The experts who made the call during the pilot flag off and unveiling of the Nutrition Support Center, NSC, at the University College Hospital, Ibadan, said poverty was not responsible for malnutrition but ignorance of the right food to eat. The project is the initiative of Community Pot, a social impact project that seeks to reduce stunting and wasting caused by malnutrition among Nigerian children. Falade, who is the Food Safety for Africa Project Coordinator and Scientist at IITA Badon, spoke on the theme, the impact of malnutrition on the economy. Lamenting that malnutrition affects health, increases in health costs, creates social problems, foodborne diseases, and results in loss in the gross domestic product GDP. The initiator of Community Port, Kemi Jeje, said if the country invested in nutrition, health expenditure would reduce, saying the project was set to to change the narrative of nutrition in Nigeria. Nutrition is forefront in the media these days everywhere. Before now, we thought what was most important was medical care. But if you invest a penny in um, nutritional care, then you can prevent thousands of expense in medical care. So, of course, leverage nutrition, uh, seasonal food, leverage what is natural and whole, and ensure that you save your costs in uh, medical care by investing in nutritional care. And healthy mothers is going to be paid for healthy babies. And since we are dealing with six months to five years, if we don't have healthy baby at birth, two months, one month, two months, three months, there's nothing we'll be talking about at six months. And that's why Oyo State is the best place to be because we start our health education right from the antenatal clinic. And we believe that when a pregnant mother eats healthy, the well-being of children and of our society as a whole because this means that people will be, be, be able to live their optimum in terms of their active life years there won't be time spent in hospitals for treating illnesses or staying at home from ill health but rather people will have the knowledge that is required to be able to live well to be able to contribute well to the society to be able to make cognitive um, um, contributions to, to the society and contributions across board providing economic growth to our country hello hope you enjoyed the news please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates